Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new streak. No, not new CFL, new streak. Whoa, 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 whoa. Game, what are you doing? I just minimized my, my game for some reason. Anyways, we got the keeper this time on our 21 streak, so keeper's definitely a little bit more risky as it goes, but not a particularly hard character nowadays. I would not say he's easy by any stretch of the imagination, but he's no longer what he used to be. Uh, he's, he's now, basically the, the thing that's really hard about him nowadays is just um, the boss fights. Everything else is, is mostly fine. Uh, so it really just depends what sort of state you're in for the boss fights. That was kind of stupid of me. Kind of stupid indeed. Especially when I'm uh, doing what I'm doing now and not getting any pennies. It also, yeah, that's another thing that it depends on as well, is how lucky do you end up getting with, um, with your active... Sometimes you can get really unlucky. Ooh. Oh my god. Does that do anything for us? I don't even know if it would. Um, at the minute, we're getting incredibly unlucky with our active. Uh, three 50-50s in a row failed. I don't like that. I'll tell you what. I don't like that. Okay, good. Try and take these guys out first. They're a little more annoying. Okay, cool. Hey, there you go. And we actually got a nickel out of that as well. Rather nice. Item room, what am I hoping for? Give me give me a little swindler. Give me a little swindler. He'd, he'd go along nicely with this run. He would he would go along quite nicely with this run. He gives me items for sale. I like it. I love it. And I do want some more of it. Uh, the question of the day, we have uh, open up a chat GPT thing here. So let's just take a look. Um, let's have a little look-see. Uh, da -da -da -da. What's a small act of kindness that you witnessed or saw recently that you were, like, I wouldn't say impressed by, but you were like, nice. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Oh, look, okay. So this, so it was it was holding out on me to give me the good shit later on. That's what was going on. It was like, don't worry, boy. I got something in store for you. Uh, get some extra bombs there as well. Rather nice. And then item room. We're gonna get a little bit of terrible... <laughs> Unfortunately, quality zero item. I do love the little visual it puts on your face, but otherwise, yeah, not not very good. Um, check in here. Toy box is so risky this early on, but I'd love it. <laughs> I'd absolutely love it. You know me and my toy box. I will basically never not take toy box, even though there's like two or three trinkets that can legitimately ruin your entire run. There's like one trinket that just turns you into the lost permanently. Right. And there's a few others that could obviously be pretty dastardly. I'm gonna say, Roma Baby 0.0, or whatever he's called, isn't actually that bad. He's just not great. Um, unfortunately, this floor has been a bit of a bust when it comes to, um... When it comes to, like, everything else. <laughs> uh, secret room... I've actually not got that big of a clue on where that could be. I'm gonna guess it's gotta be here. Yeah. Well, we can buy Toy Box if we wish. And I do indeed wish. It's, it's, it's quite the gamble. To be fair, to be fair... Allows you to use your active item without having enough charge, resulting in negative charge. Having charge reduced to your movement speed and shot speed, it, this would be a lot better for us. Because it means that if we fail our thing, we can use it more to get more charges. But this is more fun. Uh, I'm going to have to go with this just because it is just more valuable. I mean, technically what I could do is spam it a bunch and try and, uh, try and get more... Uh, more money to buy that as well, but I don't think that's super, super likely, is it? Yeah, I gotta say, I didn't really think about it when I first saw it, but after seeing it, I'm like, actually, actually, the battery thing could be good. We, we do need more speed to make it more viable, though, because otherwise our speed is gonna reach literal rock bottom pretty fucking quick. Yeah, don't, don't like what you're doing at the minute behind there. Right, 
Rabba's not great. <laughs> we got two pretty, really. We got two pretty awful items thus far. Now items are not not good. Right. Rabba is, is he's kind of okay, but otherwise it's mostly a nuisance. <laughs> but yeah, two two pretty bad item room items thus far. Dude, the money keeps rolling in though. We like that. Yeah, these guys do triple jumpies, don't they? Yeah, three jumps before they stop. Ghosty boy here. Ghosty boy is obviously bad because he can shoot spectral. We got him there, and then we got another ghosty boy over here. Where's he gone? There you go. Not all bad. Not all bad. Shop will check out, but I'm probably going to keep my money for uh, Devil Deal. Sculpting clay. Sculpting clay is so good, but we need our active. The shame with this fella having it in his full active slot rather than his pocket, but I think even in his pocket probably would be pretty strong, so I kind of understand it. Rapper's doing his thing. You get to keep a lot of our money going here. Right. Puh. I don't like the fact that there's these spectral ghosts all over the place. They have a hard time with them. But you've got two like little babies, little familiars here that are like kind of good, but not. <laughs> like, they're not awful, but they're really not great. Can you not go over the top of the rocks, please? Thank you. I should check this out because these cards can be pretty amazing. Yeah, rerolls pedestals into devil items. Um, oh, that guy can hurt me while he's on the floor. Didn't know that. Okay, so let's let's quickly just go into our um, to our shop and do that with our shop and see if we get anything good. Because they'll still cost uh, money, right? Because we're the keeper. So I should check this out. They cost hearts. I don't know what that means for us. <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't know what that means. Like, maybe if I leave the room and re-enter, it'll change to money? No. Because if that takes away an actual coin container, would be pretty devastating. So I don't think we can take those. I think they are out of the running for potential choices. Ow. Dude, the money is so good right now. So good right now. Thank you for the tinted rock. We get Mr. Boom, unfortunately. I was hoping for just a lot of bombs, but there you go. Secret room is likely to be right here, but I've, nope, it's not right there. That rooms like this are so difficult. Where the hell could secret room be? Because if, if they got the little L-shaped rooms, they could always be like right here, and I hate that. Money we are we are in a very good spot with right now, so Devil Deal Ahoy. Here we come. I'm really, really hoping from our boss we get like a decent speed up. Uh, cause that gives us more leeway when we're using our um active in overcharge mode. So I, I really don't want to overcharge it a ton, but if we can't afford something or if we really need health right now, Dad's uh, overcharge battery is gonna be super useful for exactly that. We don't need to use a bomb on this guy because he's a weak puppy. See, Grabber's doing some gnarly stuff there and uh, grabbing enemies he shouldn't be. Right, we did get a uh, Tears Up, which is obviously quite nice. A pretty good one as well. And in here we get um, Eye of Balor, which I'll definitely take. And Toy Piano is probably pretty good as well, to be honest. I'll, I'll grab Toy Piano as well. Um, and I'm pretty happy with that. Let's go down to the next floor. Yeah, still uh, still scared. I mean, this is a streak. I've got to be scared when I'm playing as the Keeper because I can't ever increase my maximum HP apart from in a few very specific scenarios. Um, but Aya Balor is real good. Doom is uh, is really good. The piano as well. 
Grab it was uh, was trying to do some shit there. He was trying to do some shit. I think Doom's pretty good as well with triple shot. I can't believe I got hit there. That was such a bad hit. Oh, dude, I almost killed myself there. See, this is where we want to do this. Didn't want to do that, but there you go. Look, that's that's where the dad's thingy is super, super valuable if we make mistakes like that. Obviously, it lowers our speed and puts us in a bit of a bad spot that way. Dude, our item rooms at the minute are fucking abysmal. Although, I will say Lost Fly is one of the better flies now that he attracts enemies towards him. Or attract shots towards him. I can't remember exactly how he works now, but he's good. Good kid. Yeah, like he, he like enemies try and run after him. Car battery is fucking amazing for us right now. Now every single time we use it, we have a du double the amount of chance to get a penny. Sometimes we can get twice the amount of pennies. It's very good stuff. Hit good, sir. Holy fuck. Ew. Double pennies. Love it. Yeah, overall, I think we're in a good spot. Boss room. We've been to, yeah, we've been to everything else we need to go to here. Did not like that. Grabber doing some weird shit here. I don't particularly know if it's a bad thing what Grabber's doing or not, but probably is, knowing him. Managed to get him as well, luckily. Oh god. Okay. I'm getting a little cheesed off at the moment, I'll be honest. All of our item rooms have been dog shit, and all of our boss items bar one have been dog shit thus far. So, getting a little cheesed off. This could really not go too well if uh, if that keeps happening. We're going to need some good items. Like, literally, we have two items that literally do nothing for us, health upgrades. And then our, our actual items we've got from item rooms have been pretty subpar. Just three familiars that are all pretty meh. Two of which are particularly meh. Trying to think of what can like alleviate this pain. What what sort of item for my next item room can be like the make me forgive? Because I'm definitely going to need some damage. Damage is a, is a clear one. My damage right now is not too good. Who's left? There's so many left. Why? Like, it's taking a while to kill things at the moment. That is everything good. Come on, item room this floor. Please be something better than we've been getting thus far. It's been a bit depressing. In here, we've got Quaker Earth's thing, which isn't particularly good, especially it being an active. Okay. I think we're going towards the boss now rather than item room. Not particularly bad, though. Devil Deal here could be good. We need something from there, maybe. Before we go to the boss fight, we need to make sure we have at least 30 cent, which we do now. Awesome. I don't know why, like, the tech baby seems sometimes to be so fucking good, and other times it's just nothing. What's going on here? Why are they all firing at him? <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but I liked it. No devil deal, unfortunately. Jesus Juice is our first good boss item, though. We did need some damage. And that is a pretty hefty bit. I like it. One moment. I've got a message incoming. Who might this be from? Okay. Good, good, good. Right. 
item room, uh, item room. Do not be the stinky. Like, this is not a bad run. I think the Devil Deal has bolstered us with some extra stuff going on here, but it still could be better. I mean, I'm very happy to have our first damager. Jesus, Jesus is a decent damager. Anything over one is a decent damager. A little bit annoyed to get that key so lit, but we're on good keys, so it's not particularly bad. Yeah, this could be an annoying Asher in this. Get out of here, you. Knowing the bejeebus out of me. Right, item room, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's just a smattering of fucking trash. <laughs> oh lord. Our item rooms so far have been, uh... Partic th this is one of those ones where it's like, this is a streak run. It's like, I'm just going to do everything I can to try and make you die at this point. Thanks, Grabber, for grabbing the inanimate object multiple times. That'll help. We're, we're really relying on our devil deals, I think, to, to make things right here. This Virtuous Soul is, is, is pretty good. Whenever we don't have a curse, we gain stats. Unfortunately, we do have a curse this floor, but I think overall that's going to be pretty useful for us. Don't even know why I've used that in here. Use my active and it's like kind of pointless right now. There's pennies all over the place. I suppose we could get some extra. But... Grab her! <laughs> Stop being a little dickhead! You make things more difficult for everyone. Not taking a pill. If I get a tears down now, I'll actually cry. We do have Curse in the Maze, so we're getting dragged around a little bit here. Come on, item room. You've got to be like, I don't know what I'm looking for. Like, give me like Toxic Shock or something to make the rooms easier. Boss, uh, Devil Deal, I'd like a twisted pair, maybe. Little, little twist of pair. That would be very, very nice. Yeah, it's like when, when he, the little robo dude passes over enemies, he can do some really good damage, but he just doesn't do that very often, so he's most of the time pretty bad. Hello, big boy. I could go into the cash room as well here, but it's a little risky. Actually, I suppose it's not that risky. Let's go into the cash room. Yeah, it's not really that risky, the cash room, considering we can produce so much money. Honestly, a sack room might not be a bad idea, to be honest. Try and get some extra stuff going. It just we, Our speed would be very low, is the only thing. Potentially, you could use my money to get better trinkets. That's... Is it good? How many item rooms have we got left? We've got, we've got two item rooms left. I'm going to say that's worth it. Two item rooms remaining. Our item room choices so far have been very bad, so... I'm going to say that trying to make better... Ch have better choices is pretty good here. Not a secret room. Very much looks like a secret room there. This also looks like a secret room too. Let me just check in here. Yeah, this could be secret room too. Go. Fireballs, moon. I guess I'll save the moon for next floor. Okay. Let's keep it going. We got a lot of extra fire at this floor because of those two water bottles that we found. Very, very nice. It's beautiful to see what everyone could be if we had this fire rate. Would be a lot, lot better for us, I can tell you that for sure. This looks secret roomy as well. I'm going to keep trying. 
Ah, well, we've already found secret room, stupid. I literally was just in there. That's just my brain being foolish. Should have used my active here. My bad. I need to get up to 30 cent again before boss, uh, the, the boss, remember. What are you doing, good sir? You gonna die? There you go. We're getting so many nickels, what the hell? Very nice. Very kind of the game right now to give us all of this. Look at that! Look what's going on with all the nickels, it's mental. Right, come on, please, 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 something better. Ugh. <laughs> Not really. Bone spares is fine, but the other item was literally worthless, so... Uh... Not, not, not happy right now. Kind of forget what's going on here with these guys. They've got whole, all new attacks that I just don't recognize at the moment, so... My bad. Okay, we're good. We did get a devil deal. Damage up, thank you. Oh, unfortunate. Please be Lump of Coal. You, if it's not Lump of Coal, I'm going to be so upset here. You... Fucker. You absolute fucker. Oh, man. This game's really taking us for a ride right now. Oh, my fire it. <laughs> my poor, poor fire it. It's so bad. I forgot about this. At one point, my fire it was gold and it was beautiful. Okay, that's fire rate. It is a damage down, and a pretty big one, but plus two fire rate is literally bumps us back up to the fire rate we were on last floor. And I think with, with our doom shot and stuff, that makes sense. Um, hmm. Got a bit of an idea in my noggin. Bit of an idea, right. Bomb this. One. And two. See what's in here. Marbles is fine. We pop this until we get our health back. Warp zone's causing errors. We've got a very good trinket here that literally makes us fire twice. I like that. This is good. This is very good. Although I think he only fires a single shot. I think he fires triple shot. But... He fires alongside us, I like that. Good shit. You see, that was that was some smarts right there, wasn't it? That was some absolute smarts that I just had. This is why this uh this dad's overcharge thing is really, really good. Allows us to do some stuff we wouldn't normally be able to do. And I quite like that. Oh, my little ghost died. Wait, what? Oh, no, I smelted it. I was like, where's it gone? But I smelted it. Wait, that's actually a good thing. Now I can go back over here and I can grab... This bad boy. Two Abyss Locusts. Monsters may drop spinning pennies on death if to their max HP. That's actually pretty goddamn good. Um... I kind of want to smell a lot of these. Okay. I can I can do some stuff to uh, potentially give myself some extra smelts here, which would be really, really nice. And I think I kind of need to. Right. Quickly go back here. Really? Nothing? With car battery, you thought I'd be getting more procs of this, but it's not happening. Just not happening right now. With one penny. Gimme, gimme. Come on, smelt, smelt me up for something beautiful. Why no smelty? 
I know it's, I think it's only like a 5% chance with marbles to smelt your trinket, so it's not super high or anything. But I would like it. If we could smell a little more. Ooh, sack room here. Okay. Come back to that. Hmm. I'm okay for the shockwave for item, thank you. Right, we've not got many rooms left, so this isn't going to work, like, fully here. Two pennies in there, that's good. Might need to lose some speed to do this. We did get a speed up at some point. I think that was from uh, Thingy Mush, Thin Mushroom. Right, a little bit tedious here, but I'm going to keep doing this. I, d I don't need to place them in this room, it's just easier. If we can get a good smattering of thingies here, we can play a sack room, potentially get a good item out of it. Which would be pretty lovely. Right, let's start doing it now. This all this will also help us smelt stuff too, which is nice. It's it's multifunctional. Did we pick up a penny back, didn't there? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. We did get an item, but it's a trash item. <laughs> Jelly Belly is incredible. We'll definitely take Jelly Belly. Unfortunately, yeah, Communion, not too good for us. But Jelly Belly, very good. Unfortunately, no smell either. Bit of a shame. But overall, getting Jelly Belly out of that anyways is, is very, very worthwhile. Apple of Pride is kind of nice for a decent stat boost for a little while. We've got a shop here as well. Got plenty of keys, we'll check it out. Uh, unfortunately, nothing there that we want. Right, let us go. Boss time it is. We're on to Mum. I'm feeling better now that we've got Jelly Belly. Chance to just negate damage is pretty beautiful. A fire is rather nice as well now. It means that Doom is proccing quite often. Good, good. Right. Oh, down we go. I think I think we're in a situation where it's hard for us to die. It's just still kind of this this run just feels risky. Really, my ghost died immediately, Are you kidding? I was hoping to keep him around for a little while longer than literally half of the first room, but I guess that's too much to ask. We're getting unlucky on our devil deals as well. First one was good, but our last few haven't been so hot for us. Oh my god. There's some shenanigans going on with this guy right now. That's a, a lot of pennies, my dear. It's a lot of pennies. That's a cool room. Finish the room and it just laser beams all of those. Right. Hopefully we're going the right way here, but you never really know. Yeah, straight the right way, good. Ow. Playing cards. Three random keys. Three, of Three random hearts. Three and turn everything into bombs. I see you there, shyster. Hey, I finally gulped my trinket. Lovely. Devil deal. Yeah, baby. Lovely. And we get ourselves gusty blood is something at least. Especially the fire, it's quite nice. And we'll get going. Okay. The run's still in, in the balance. It's still sketchy. Not lose our ghost immediately this time either. Wrong way straight away. More money there that I don't really need. God damn, the money's just been rolling in, like I said. It's crazy. Man. 
whoever in their little mind was like, yeah, smaller versions of those guys would be fun. Devil. A devil in disguise. You knew the pain that you were inflicting on this world, and you did it anyways. Devil cards, whatever. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. Devil card. Activates the Bible. Okay, we can use that on the mother fight. Just hope we can actually find the boss at a reasonable speed here. Got a lot of wrong ways to go first. Luckily, like, I got, we've gotten to the point now with our stats and damage where we're in a pretty good spot and we're kind of killing stuff pretty goddamn quickly, so that's not a problem anymore, at least. And we've always got pennies around as well, like I said. We're hard to kill. Yeah, he's like, get over here, thank you. This looks to be the right way. Oh, we got one of these. Hello. That bad, bad boy. Get rid of you real quick. See what we get from you. Normally this is just HP ups you get from these, so this probably won't be great, but I might as well do it anyways. Yeah. Shot speed, I guess, is useful. Otherwise, not, not great, obviously. But this should insta-kill. Yeah. It, it uses the Bible, so it just insta-kills. Nice, we get another devil deal here, lovely. And a pretty good item to boot as well, thank you. And up we go. Okay, I think I think we're set. I think we're in a good spot. Our damage is much better now. I think we're all good. I'm sure we can find the boss at a reasonable speed here. What are you doing? The noise is scary. Go through the large rooms first if you can. It's all about finding our way now, but not exactly easy. I don't know, sometimes I just do this thing where like I'll just automatically choose every single right way on a run, and then other times it'll be like every dead end plausible. I'm sure that happens to literally everyone, but it feels like... I don't know, it feels like... The, the run had it out for me sometimes, and other times it's like... It's kind of like when you're driving and um, all the lights turn green for you sort of thing. <laughs> like, nothing you can do to influence it, but sometimes it happens and you're just like, oh my god. It has blessed me on this day. We're speeding through these rooms now. What do all these little dudes do? Do they make them fire more? Sketchy room there, but we got through it. Ooh, you do damage, okay. I thought I, th I thought you were one of the ones that just dies at the end of the room when everything else dies. Dude, having this Doom on seems to be helping a lot as well. It stacks up so fast with our current fire rate, and it seems to insta-kill every time it pops. Nice. Let me out. We've got to be near the boss now. Come on, game. Got a really itchy arm for some reason as well. God damn. Oh, man. While I'm on a streak, you got to be kidding me. Yeah, I I'm just loving the fact that we're getting these like runs like this that start it started off kind of really like, oh, shit, this could be super bad. And we've kind of turned it around, even if our item rooms were pretty trash. Like, almost all of them were pretty trash. I don't know how often we can doom an enemy. We just did it then, but I don't know if we can do it again straight away. Uh, we, okay, it seems to be every, like, ten seconds or so, maybe. Careful with your feathers. Yeah. I'm gonna say, we're gonna have to go through a few uh, rigmaroles with the old light beams, but... It seems like we got this guy dead pretty quick. Oh, there you go. 
caught him off guard there. And we've got keys for days here, so... Hopefully get some good items to finish off the last floor. Boom. Model rocket's good. Um, spider bite's good. Job earns whatever. This is whatever. Yeah, model rocket just is a lot of bonus damage for a little bit of delayed gratification. You gotta wait a little bit for your tears to actually hit, but they hit bloody hard. You can clearly see it's like a pretty big increase to our damage overall. It's much better with like multi shots as well, I think I feel like. I forget the little ghost. Ooh, Proptos is very nice. I forget the little ghost also makes it so that you pl place an additional bomb. But yeah, with Proptos, this will be like absolutely mega. Everything's just gonna die instantly now. I'm just gonna be a little careful because I think my range with um with the rockets plus Proptosis is especially low now. But the damage is especially high, so. I just gotta be a little cautious about where I stand. And also, now that we've got so much speed going on, we can kind of spam coins in the last room and be fine. Oh, my little ghosty died. That's kind of a shame. And I gain extra speed from um, Gusty Blood or whatever it is. Boss fight time. I get a penny down there. Another penny down there. I'm trying to smatter pennies throughout the room so that I've got them available. I've accidentally picked up one already. I'm still at 1.3 speed. As you can see, I'm actually, I think Proptosis might have been a bad idea. I'm doing really low damage to this guy. I've got to sound very close for him to get good damage going. But since I've killed enemies, I've gained more uh, thingy here. Thank you, Jawbone. Yeah, I'm not particularly happy with how this is going. I can't really see what's going on. It's very visually distracting. And I have to be very, very close to this guy to deal good damage. He has a lot of gnarly attacks when you're close. But if I get really, really close, it kind of destroys him, so it's neither here nor there. I'm still at 1.6 speed here as well, so if I need to create coins, I can. Yeah. We've got 12 uses of this, even if it does lower our speed each time, so it's not... Yeah, it did, definitely saved our life. Definitely saved our life, but we got through it. We did it. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.